everyone, so today I just want to show you um, a couple of hampers that I've done for gifts. Um, I just find hampers um, are really handy if you have no clue what to get a person or a couple or even a family. And if you could just put together a few items in a cute little basket, I find it's a really nice sort of um, gift for around Christmas or actually any time of year. Um, but I've done two hampers, so I'm going to show you what I've put in them. They've basically got the same and it's for a couple. Both of them are for, for couples. Obviously, they can share them with the children as well. But it's, you know, my mind thought was for a couple. They could sit down, you know, Christmas time, you know, together and go through it some nice nibbles um i got two baskets these baskets i actually got half price from home base and also i thought about what their home decor was like because um the person i got this one for it would go really nicely in the home so they can use the basket again and obviously i just put some pretty like ribbon and stuff around just to make it more festive again i chose this basket because i know it would go in their home as well um yeah so i'm going to show you i'm going to pull bits out um, one by one and show you what I've put inside. Just got a couple of candy canes, there's two here, just for like extra festiveness and who doesn't love a candy cane. Um, so I put in some Sainsbury's Taste the Difference roast turkey and herb stuffing crisps, hand cooked. These just look like luxury crisps and they sound really good. I also put in some of these Ebchin stars. I don't know if I've even said that right, but um, they look really, really good. And they did actually have these two for two pounds in Sainsbury's. Um, very festive and they just sound really good. And it's a good size bag as well. So I put them in there. I also picked up the mini festive pretzels, cheese um, snack flavour. These would be great for kids as well, but these are just a great little um, nibble. I made like a couple's um, hot chocolate so they can divvy out the um, marshmallows these are like Christmas tree marshmallows and then um, there's two actually types of hot chocolate there's a, a galaxy on the top and then more teas on the bottom so they can um, just sprinkle it in their cups or however they make their um, hot chocolate but yeah there's a, basically two portions in there I also put in some after eight mints kind of a staple around this time of year and I just love them I added two crackers, just, I had loads of crackers that I bought last year, and I just thought, you know, just make it look extra festive. I also popped in some brandy snaps. Again, this sort of year, it's the time for brandy snaps, and they looked really good, so I got a box of those to put in. And last couple of items, I actually, from uh, one of the Christmas stalls, I found a local handmade fudge uh, maker and I there were so many different flavors but I chose um, four flavors I chose the chocolate and mint the strawberries and cream walnut and coffee which I think might be that one and then also uh, just a regular original um, vanilla fudge so um, yeah I, I basically just bought a couple of blocks um, small blocks cut them up myself and just put them in these little bags again with ice topped mince pies kind of festive this time of year a bit of a luxury um, and I love a mince pie, so I had to put them in there. And then lastly, I just thought I'd put a bottle of bubbles in, a bottle of Prosecco. They were doing them on offer, um, two for something in Sainsbury. So um, yeah, so that is pretty much um, what I put in the Christmas hampers for two couples. Um, again, you know, you can just customize it to what they like. You know, if they like beer, then just put beer in there or um, if they like wine just put wine in there you know that sort of thing and just um, you know personalize it to whoever who it, whoever it is also with like hampers like I say you can do it for a family so you can do a bigger hamper they don't have it doesn't have to be expensive like this didn't cost me like a ridiculous amount I'd say it's probably cheaper than buying a gift for every single person as well and it's just um, I think it's really really nice idea I'd quite like to receive one myself so I actually bought these um, sort of hamper cellophane sort of sets from eBay. They were only £2.50. I bought two of them just in case I didn't have enough. But in each um, pack there is actually like pretty much enough um, cellophane. There's like two metres. I'll leave it linked below actually if you fancy having a look. They do different themes and stuff and even plain stuff. Um, but yeah, they basically do enough for probably about two hampers actually. Um, so yeah, it comes with ribbon, it comes with the cellophane, which this one I got, which was a bit more festive. And I thought it was quite nice with the Father Christmas, the reindeer and the snowmen on. Um, and then um, it comes with the ribbon and it comes with um, the tissue paper as well that you can you could line the basket with or whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm going to wrap them up and show you how it turns out. 
So this is the finished hamper. As you can see, it's all done, it's all put together, and it was so ridiculously easy. All I did was literally lay out the um, cellophane and just gather um, each corner and just to make it look pretty, tuck a few bits in, literally tie it, and then I added the pretty bow, which actually already comes with it. Um, you just kind of make it up. It gives you like a how-to step. Um, here actually, just gives you like a how-to step. Um, to make the bow, I added the little tag for who it's for. And that is pretty much the hamper. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope it's been helpful if you're looking for last minute gift ideas. Um, yeah, and that's the other one that I need to wrap as well. And I'm going to add um, this little tag to it, which is quite cute.